Hi there, and welcome to I'm Only Human, a podcast that attempts to explain how to coexist with other humans. This podcast is going to dive into topics like, is it possible to overcome human nature? Are rules and laws necessary for taming bad behaviors? Or are they simply a control mechanism crafted by other disturbed minds? Why do we fight with each other? How does traditional religion impact us? My name is Jen, and I'm an average human. Before I begin, I would like to state that I will be talking about controversial things such as, but not limited to, God, the Bible, religion, 12-step programs, and politics. I am not an expert, and I don't claim to be one. I'm not trying to promote a particular program, nor am I trying to convert anyone. I believe that religion gives us a foundation, and 12-step recovery guides people down a path to self-actualization. Through recovering, through recovery, healing is possible. I believe that changed minds and attitudes can change our world. This is my very first live episode, live recorded episode, whatever you want to call it. So I'm a bit nervous here. Um, I do have a podcast. It's got quite a few episodes and it is on Spotify. The name of it is I'm Only Human by Jennifer Bradley. You have to look it up. And there's plenty of content there. I've been really hesitant and really nervous about doing this on video as well. But we'll see how it goes. I like to share where I get my inspiration from. And the inspiration from this came from a couple people that I quote unquote met through X and they don't know me. And I don't know them. I just know them because of listening to their YouTube channels and getting to know them through their content. And they're pretty awesome people. So um, Lindsay, who's an addiction counselor, has been an addiction counselor for 10 years. She's really smart and she likes to do these live stream things with um, her buddies. And I, another shout out to um, Scott. Uh, the Sober Heathen. So you can find both of them on YouTube and on X. I just happened to stumble upon them one day and I was fairly new to X. And they're like, I don't know, maybe we're destined to find each other. I don't know. But I like listening to them talk. I myself am not an alcoholic, um, but I've lived around alcoholism growing up and even now i live around alcoholism and it's sad to be in a relationship and it's sad to have family members who have this problem sorry i'm a bit nervous (laughs) um but i just like to hear other people's stories and get other perspectives um I'm in a couple 12 step programs and they help me out. It's like, I don't follow them to a T and I'm not like rigid about it or anything because I take my recovery where I take my recovery. And it's usually through podcasts and things like that. And um, there's a bunch of links in the show notes to my podcasts that are on um, Spotify to all of these people and all of these shows that have inspired me but I'm a bit nervous today. So um, I'll give a shout out to all of them people in another episode. So this is just a little tiny introduction and it'll get better as things go by. Um, I can't wait to get some people on here, some guests on here, Jason from Accountability Nation. I can't wait to talk to him. And I'm sure if some of you already know who he is, you wouldn't mind hearing his story again. I mean, he's told it over and over, but it is a pretty awesome story. I'll give you a teaser, though. He died, and he loves to talk about it. So with that, I'm going to sign off from my first episode. And in closing, <coughs> pardon me. <laughs> in closing, I'd like to say that the opinions expressed here were strictly of my own making. You may not like me or what I want to say. But that's okay. Let's talk to each other, reason things out, but let there be no gossip or criticism of one another. 
Instead, let the fellowship of ethical human behavior and the serenity from positive human interaction help you grow and chill out one experience at a time. I would like to thank my higher power for guiding me through this podcast. I hope to spread the message of love, hope, and understanding by touching one life at a time. Thank you.